Now let's draw this drawing and for that I will start from this point. You can see uh, we have a reference of 30.31 unit. So maybe I will start from here. So let's draw 30.31 then press enter. Then I will move in this direction. You can see the distance from this point to this point is 45. So let's draw it 45 press enter and then I will press enter again. Now here you can see we have to draw a circle of a radius 12. So let's draw a circle of a radius 12. Press enter. Now here as well we have to draw the same circle. So maybe I will select this and copy it from its center and then place it here. And after that I will press enter. Now I will delete these two lines. So simply delete it. And after that, what I will do is uh, I'm going to draw a line here from this tangent to this tangent. So let's simply take a line and before clicking on that, I will just simply press and hold shift, right click and then click on this tangent. Then just simply click here. Then again, I'll do the sa same thing. Press shift, right click and then click on tangent and then click here. And after that, I'll press escape. Now what I will do is I will just simply select these and mirror it and then press enter. Now I will do the same thing here as well. So for that I will take the line, press and hold shift, right click here then click on tangent. Then I will click here and then shift, right click and then click on tangent and then after that I will click here just simply press enter. Now after that we have to draw a circle and you can see from this point to this point the unit is 25. So let's draw it then press enter. So the radius of this circle is again 12. So let's draw it press enter. Now we have to draw this circle. So you can see the radius of this circle is 20. But before that we have to reach to this point. So I will draw a line. I will go to its center and you can see the distance from this point to this point. You can see uh, this is 30.31. So let's move in this direction by 30.31. Press enter. And then in this direction the distance is 12.5. The center of this. press enter and then press enter again. You can see we have to draw a circle of radius 20. So let's draw a circle of radius 20 and then press enter. Now what we have to do is we have to get rid of the extra lines. So you can simply select this and delete it from here. You can trim it. You can trim this part. You can trim this, this, this. And you can press escape and you can just simply select this and delete it from here. Now I will just simply select this and mirror it to the other side just like this and then press enter. Now we have to create an offset of two unit as you can see here but before that we have to simply join this. So for that I will simply select this and type J and then press enter. Now I'm going to create an offset of two unit as you can see this is the two unit. So type O, type 2, enter and then click here and then offset it like this. After that press enter. Now that we have completed this part let's move to this side. So for that uh, I will start from this point and the farthest point is uh, this 23. So 23 press enter and the in this direction that this uh, distance is 10.5 10.5 press enter and we have to find this height. So if you see here you can see this is to 23 this is 16. If you subtract that you are going to get 7 and you have to subtract this distance as well which is 2. So the distance is 5. So 5 then enter then just simply match it with this then press enter. Now again press enter repeat the command. Uh, this distance is 2, so 2 and then enter 
and this distance that you are seeing here is 14. 14 enter now we have to find this uh, this height you can see if you subtract this 16 minus 8 that will be equal to 8 and after that you have to subtract this which is 2 so after that you are going to get 6 so type 6 and then match it with this and then press enter now I'll start from this point so press enter then click here and then in this direction the distance is 18 Then we then this thickness is eight. Then simply match it with this, and then press enter. Now what I'm gonna do is uh, I need to get rid of the overlapping lines, so I can just simply select this. Or maybe I can just simply select this whole drawing like this and type overkill. Press enter, and then click on OK. Now what I will do is I will just simply select these. Uh, before that, I would like to create an offset. So I will just simply create an offset of five unit. You can see here, five enter, and then click here, and then make it offset like this. Then I will trim the pa a part which I don't require. Trim enter, click here, click here, and then click here. After that, I will press escape. Now I will select these and mirror it. Simply click here and then here, just like this. Now you can see, although we have mirrored this part, we are not getting this. So simply click on no. You can see we have, we have not selected this part. So that's why this one is not mirrored there. So you can simply select it like this. Now you can mirror it click here and then here and then press enter now we need to get rid of this line simply select this and delete it from here now here as well we can see we have a line so we can select it and you can delete it and you can see this is our final drawing